this video I've come up with making of this hand embroidery flower. It's called as pollen knot stitch or also called as long stank French knot stitch. It's the multi-purpose flower used for designing and decorating. I'd be using this anchor thread having the six strands. The making of this mirror frame I've shown in my earlier video. If you haven't watched it, the link is in front of your screen. Please check out. Pull the needle just adjacent to this mirror frame. Hold the string tightly like this and place the needle underneath this string. Bind the string to this needle 4 to 5 times or else rotate it like this. So you have given 5 rotations holding the string tightly. Insert the needle in like this and pull it to another side. You can see here I am giving the French knot. So for this flower we have to give one long stitch and then on either sides with the small size. See again I have inserted the needle and giving the rotations of 5. This time I am giving the long stitch. Hold the string firmly and pull it back. So now I will make the smaller one. So one big one small like that we have to continue to complete this flower. This is so simple and easy to do. And you can do this designing on the plain saris or the dupattas for the necklines or the plain chudidar tops. You can also use these decorative flowers for the table covers, pillow covers and the cushion covers. Within no time we can create this design of flowers. In the center instead of mirror you can also use the kundans or beads. This is how the stitches continue. One long stitch and one short stitch. You can also use the silk threads instead of this embroidering threads. I am done with this pollen stitch. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you like it, please hit the like icon. Please do share with your friends and relatives. Thank you so much for watching. Meet you all with another interesting video. Subscribe and stay tuned to watch more videos of latest fashions and trends.